No disintegration. As you wish. He's no good to me dead. What if he doesn't survive? Put Captain Solo in the cargo hold. Despite only four lines of dialogue and six and a half minutes total screen time in the original Star Wars films, Boba Fett is a fan favourite. And now he's played by Kiwi favourite Timuera Morrison. After seemingly dying in Return of the Jedi, the bounty hunter made a surprise return in The Mandalorian Season 2. <laughs> uh, uh, Boba! Meeting uh, Kahaki Kuta! Now, in another Star Wars spin-off series, The Book of Boba Fett, he returns to stake his claim on the territory once ruled by Jabba the Hutt. Left for dead on the sands of Tatooine. I am Boba Fett. Tony Lyle caught up with the man himself and his co-star, Ming-Na Wen. Congrats on the series, incredible stuff. I want to ask, what is it about Boba Fett, you reckon, that makes him such a fan favourite? Mysterious. Mysteriousness, quietness, <laughs> by himself, the lone, handsome bounty hunter. <laughs> Asteroid. Fearsome. With an amazing more. accent. Did you slip any sort of New Zealand colloquialisms in there, Tim, at all? Yeah, every now and then I, in my fight scene, I'd sort of go, do it, do it, do it. And these are all our haka noises that we make when we're doing the haka. So every now and then I go, do it, do it, do it. And then the sound guy would come over and go, Tim, Tim, uh, you're making these strange noises when you do your fight scene. You're going, D, D, D. And I said, oh, leave those in. And therefore, all my boys back in Rotorua are doing the haka. Do <laughs> <laughs> um, Ming Na, did Tim oh, teach you anything uh, New Zealand based that you could throw in for you? Oh, all the time. I mean, I'm learning a lot about the culture and uh, I want to learn the haka. I'm very excited. It, it just, it's such an energizer. It's, you know, it, there's there's so much, like you just feel the the, the power and, but- Yeah, every um, now and then, late in the afternoon, late in the afternoon on the sands of Tatooine somewhere. Yeah. And the energy starts to um, okay, yeah. go down a little bit towards the end. So I pick everybody up by getting into. Oh, oh. Oh, I love it. I love it. Up. And then love away it. we go. So that haka yeah. is a great form of energy. Yes. Well, you are you are the, the there, best at coming back to life, Tim. You mean your characters come back to life? It must be great to have you another crack at it. Great. It's great. Fortunately, yes. I played Django Fett back in the day and fortunately Boba Fett was a clone son so fortunately he had to look like Django <laughs> so I was very fortunate and I count my blessings and a big you know I was just so proud to wear to wear the costume I've got to ask this for the whole of New Zealand before I go who would win in a fight Boba Fett or Jake the Muss uh, <laughs> Take the muscle, of course. Hey. Hey. <laughs> we'll finally put that one to bed. Hey.